the guys from Gleason again we're gonna measure up some of these frames and there was a couple things I wanted to quick show you guys before before getting into the measurement session there's one thing that always happens with us when we start when we start up our tracker I go through all the the startup and I, I make sure everything is all placed in the in the right spot for me and when I get my setup but what I always notice is that when I get my uh, my first shot at the SMR I'll quick make a little communication here a little uh, signal coming back Notice what happens, my green light keeps blinking on my tracker. I still track, which is fine. You can kind of see that thing moving around. So that's kind of cool. But I'd like that green to go away. And the best way to do that is, I'll put the, uh, the SMR back in the home position and come into Polyworks with me. I've got V14 live here. And down in this icon or this uh, tool tray here, all you have to do is send that, that beam home. Okay, so look at that, it runs to the home position. It's kind of sampling what's going on inside of that SMR for a second. You can see my, uh, my cursor is still kind of thinking about that. It'll take it just a second, and then it'll start to go solid green. So now I've got that beam solid green. All right, so now I'm ready to start tracking. But uh, that kind of happens to us all the time. So what you do is just send that thing for home, uh, send the SMR to the home, hit home in Polyworks, and it'll sample the inside of that SMR, and you're ready to measure. <laughs> 